Hi pre-k friends. Today we're going to read a story entitled I Will Be Fierce. If you remember, um, we did read this one in our class. So the word fierce can sometimes mean like wild or bad, but it could also mean that you're really intense and really excited about something like this little girl in the story. And I also know that in your packets, you've been reading a story about a little girl who goes to a museum and sees a portrait that really inspires her. And sometimes if we make a portrait of ourselves, we might want to stand nice and tall and proud and fierce, just like this little girl. So let's see what's making her so fierce, what she has to be so fierce about. So the author is B. Birdsong, and then the illustrator, the person who drew the pictures, is Nidhi Chanani. Okay. Here's the title page, I Will Be Fierce. Today, I will be fierce. I will answer the call to adventure. I will put on my armor. I will fill my treasure chest. Ooh, she's using words that make her sound like, like she's a knight going into battle or that. She has lots of treasures. What, what's her treasure chest here? Yeah, her backpack. You can also find your backpacks and pretend to fill it up with all of your special things, all your treasures. I will go forth to explore new worlds. Today, I will be fierce. I will take on the monsters that stand in my way. What? Do you see any monsters over there? Are there any monsters on the pages? <laughs> no, there's just those dogs, but Maybe for people who might be scared of dogs, they might seem like they're monsters. I will drive back the dragons. Oh, now she's pretending they're dragons. I will dare to walk with the giants. So look, there she is. And remember we talked about signs, so it's important to read signs. Here's the sign for the, yeah, the bus stop. So look, who are the giants? Yeah, it's just all these big kids around here, but sometimes if you're small, it can feel kind of scary to have a lot of big, tall people around you. I will charge the many-headed serpent. <gasps> Ooh, a serpent is like a big, scary snake. What is she pretending is the big, scary snake with lots of heads? Yeah, her school bus. Today, I will be fierce. I will chart my own course. So, everybody's going this way. So she's trying to chart her own course. So figure out which way she needs to go. I will climb the mountain of knowledge. I will trick the guardian of wisdom into revealing her secrets. So who is the guardian of wisdom? What do you think that woman does? Yeah, she's the school librarian, just like Miss Wagner is our school librarian. And she can also tell you some great things and share her wisdom and knowledge. I will solve the mysteries of the unknown. Today, I will be fierce. I will break away from the ordinary. I will stand up for my beliefs. I will build new bridges. 
So look, she saw that nobody was sitting with this little girl and she was all by herself. So she went over and asked her to sit with her. So there isn't a real bridge here, right? But when you say you're building bridges, it means like you're reaching out to somebody and like making friends with them. I will search for light in the darkness. Today, I will be fierce. I will claim my victory. So here it says, show and tell, which is kind of like what we do now during our classroom meetings on the computer. I will conquer my fears. I will make my voice be heard. I will be the hero of my story. Today, I will be fierce. I will lead the way home. And then, I will rest. For tomorrow, I will be fierce again. Okay, thank you for sharing that story with me, friends. Bye.